Well, that could have gone better. I do need this. All right, so now we're pushing forward. That was amazing. Come on, Elizabeth. Let's go find Daisy in the factory. The gates are open. It was amazing, except for the whole, you know, not being able to get off the damn thing before it crashed. Other than that, though, it was pretty sweet. What the hell? Well, you guys know how to make an entrance, that's for sure. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, these Vigors, they sure don't discriminate. Everybody's a target. Oh. It's definitely time for Carbine. Who did that? Was it you? Better watch yourself. She was coming here for Fink. We need to take that elevator up. Bet at least to Fink's office. But first, gear. Ooh, increases clip size. I like the sound of that. I'll equip that. Oh, yeah, now I can hold 18. Nice. All right, well, that way it's not going to work. Going up. Now oh, they're manufacturing the vigors. And the vending machines. Those shock jockey things. Man, Fink is manufacturing everything, and what's gonna happen when we kill him? They're just right for each other, aren't they? Who? Fitzroy and Comstock. Lynn. My god, I, I was so set on getting to Paris, I, I didn't really think that... You couldn't have known this would happen. I had a role in this catastrophe. If, if you want to pretend that we're purely innocents in this, then that's your prerogative, but... Oh god, here we go again. Um, uh, hello? Think? I saw you die, Booker. With my own eyes. Fitzroy. Listen, I got you your guns. I'm here for my airship. But my Booker DeWitt died for the Vox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. My Booker DeWitt was a hero to the cause, a story to tell your children. You. You just complicate the narrative. Hmm. So. Wait. Part of me thinks I was supposed to die on that airship. Like, that was the whole point. But, or, either that or I just suck and fail at escaping. I don't know. What? Hey! Alright then, I see how it is. 
So everybody's an enemy now. If that's how it has to be, then that's how it has to be. That was a fair amount of money. Alright, so what's this way then? Vending machines! In fact, I haven't been possessing vending machines, like, at all. It costs a lot of salt, though. More money. Cash. Well, I won't say no to more money. Uh, let's see how much it gives me. I have 551. Holy hell. Do they always give you that much? Pretty much. Could be worth the salts, actually. Let's get that volley gun damage boost. Because I love me some volley gun damage boosts. Oh, recoil decrease for carbine. I want it. Oh. Yeah. I like the sound of this. Damage boost 2. I need more vending machines to possess. The hell? Okay, random invisible wall. You can't even at least let me go to the door. That's weird. Did I see. Aha. Uh -huh. Secret gear. 30% chance melee target becomes possessed. Still not enough for anything. Oh man. Crow's boost. Stun duration, that's good. Possession for less. I saw that a while ago. And I still I kinda want it now. Shock chain. These all seem really handy, but they're so damn expensive. It's not enough money. What the hell is this? Some octopus Cthulhu monster on there or something. I didn't get to see the name. Undertow. Interesting. Oh. Cool. Once again, I can play it, and the game gives me what I want. Ah, oh, damn. Should I get recoil decrease? I could afford more. More damage. And recoil decrease. Alright, my machine gun's fully upgraded. Carbine recoil sounds fantastic. Is there anything else I may have overlooked? Nah. Process right, then. seems to be irreversible. <laughs> Perhaps, though, 
Comstock will have some need of this kind of thing to keep watch in that tower he is building. Yeah, it's, it's talking about Songbird. Got a lock, needs picking. Sure thing. There. Alright, so maybe we'll get to try out Undertow in this room. Maybe. Okay. 